children just inside the mind of the grand head of the Psychonauts? It's not his mind. Darling, we saw you come out. That's an incredible security violation. Listen, that's the mole. Kid, you're way behind. The mole is Nick from the mailroom. Sasha just figured it out. But I always had my suspicions. Why, there he is, over there. No, that's the Cesarevich of Glulovia. Or at least his body. His mind is in my dad's head. Ugh, we don't have time for this. Let's go get my dad's brain. Out of my way. Did she just say... Gah. I think we should get out of here. Oh, Lord, y'all done fucked up. Little Zazarvich, have you come to pay for your father's sins? Yes, High Priestess. I am here to correct the mistakes made by my father. I am Glistal Malek, son of Tsar Theodore, rightful ruler of Grulovia and servant of Maligula. Lucy, this isn't you. We can fight this together. Four, you're here too. This is awkward. Ah, there's so many people here. Too much baggage. Need to. <gasps> Lily, wait. That doesn't look good. I'm going to need the family. <laughs> and the power from the psychic beaver. Look at him. Giant fucking buck teeth. I love him. Oh, come on, don't do that in the middle of my jump. Is Maligula doing that? Of course she's doing that. Uh. Oh, wow. I didn't expect that that was going to actually, like, hurt me. Let's just wait up a bit. Now go. Oh shit. That is water. I can tell if that was water or not. It's a little dark in here. Where the fuck? Can I get up there, please? No? I don't think I'm supposed to be down here. Give me some good old side pops. Ooh, I should get some of those too. My mental energy has been lagging a little. Um. Combine. I have no cores. I have not been leveling up my powers that much. I hope my family is still at the camp. I've been forgetting all about it. Oh, he remembered. Your father had a rough night. He's been remembering things. Sorry your mom's dead, I dude. Lost the Rasputin.
You know what we have to do. Mio caro. No tears, my love. It's showtime. Time for the devil's fire hose. Quip it on the bottom. Now, rescue him. Up top you go. But what about all that water? The curse isn't real, Dad. It's just something Ford put in our minds to keep us safe. You sure about that? Of course he's not sure. But what choice does he have? You ready, Raz? No. So do it quick. I don't think physics worked that way, but it's pretty cool though. Cut that shit out, Grandma! Oh, that's creepy. <laughs> A face in the water, and you got some lights back there. Some staring at me. All right, can I examine this? That's right, and there's more where that came from. Huh. Guess I'm going through the water. This is cheery. Hmm. My grandparents were part of the protests in Grulovia after the war. It didn't end well. Yeah, they died. Here's a scene I was hoping not to see again. Hmm. So that's my real grandma, grandpa. Grandma Morona, my real Grandma Morona, and my dad's father, Lazarus. Nice to see them alive, actually. Man, you guys are uh, some skeletons. Trying to get a good look at the skeletons. Aw, that's sad. That makes me sad. Very sad. Way maligulugly, maligulugly, malugly. Yeah, I gotta practice that before I meet her for real. <laughs> I gotta practice that. So do I shoot it? Oh no, I don't shoot it. I um, we haven't done this since like the first level. Burn that shit down. Ooh, I'm gonna pay for that later. Oh, trust me, we will. We will, Raz. Raz, 
I'm your great nephew. <laughs> I mean, not that I think I'm great or anything. Just that you're my grandma's sister. And I'm here to talk you out of being evil because, you know, you're still family and all. Family? All I see is another unruly Grumovian peasant. Oh, come on, Nona. Don't be like that. Water snakes. Oh boy. Didn't expect that. Esmeralda is cool. Uh -oh. You're cool too, Sam. Careful, children. Oh, I fear a storm. It's coming. Hmm? She reminds me of Yzma. <laughs> I thought that was my uh my side blast. Okay, side blast. Telekinesis. Uh clairvoyance. Overgrown lust for violence and destruction. Ah! That sounded really, than I wanted it to. Really, really hurt. I have to. What the fuck? What am I, a cockroach? Oh god. Alright. Jesus fuck. You're really like fucking me up. Shit. Uh come on, come on, come on, fire, 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 fire. Those two are the coolest. <laughs> I like those two the most.
As long as I keep moving, I should be fine. Ow. Fuck. I wish my side blasts were a little bit more powerful, you know? I still hate you, Norma. Sorry, I thought you were the mole, Raz. Go Let fuck yourself, out. Norma. But that was pretty cool. Ooh, she looks steamed. Go. Oh, shit. You really got to dodge at the last second for that one. Never underestimate the power of pirate radios. Mama came to me, upset about some terrible mistake she had made. So we put the word out on KLOB, and guess what? People were listening. At least one of them, and they told the others. Thanks, Morris. Oh shit. Exclusive on air interview for this, okay? You got it, buddy. Oh no! <laughs> Marona wasn't supposed to be there. Lazarus shouldn't have brought her. He killed my sister. No, that's not quite right. No, that's not quite right. Will they listen? I... I killed my sister. I might not be your real grandmother. I killed my sister. But you're still my family! But so much, huh? <laughs> Jesus <laughs> fuck! <laughs> Thing I can offer now is everything I've got. Oh, I'm giant Raz again. But there's room for one more. Oh, I wish I had made you bigger. It's okay, Nona. Look behind her. Dug 
his little hole after all. <laughs> yep, and we're gonna fill it. Pyro breath. Oh. Get your ass back there. Ah. Uh. Oh no! You can't get rid of me! I'm a part of her! Big deal. Everybody's got something like you. We just know how to keep it where it belongs. Long live the king. Damn, she really got Mufasa. <laughs> oh, no, no. Bye. <laughs> you got the brain. Do you have a funnel? That's it. Caligula gets to live out in Green Needle Gulch with Ford as if she didn't just try to kill people. You'd be hey, the last one to talk. <laughs> the monster. And, and then, uh, and now, uh, I think she deserves a second chance. And I think I deserve a vacation. My brain's been through a lot. Oh, no, you don't. I've kept this place afloat during your little nap, and now I'm taking two of the 17 weeks of vacation I've saved up to lie in a beach where none of you can find me. Right after we take care of some important Psychonauts business. Yeah! Well, are you coming or not? I'm gonna be an official Psychonaut. Despite my best efforts, you interns have seen some really inappropriate things. But I think you've also learned a truth that every psychonaut should know. That there are flaws in our most venerated institutions, in our heroes, and in ourselves. We all make mistakes, and we all need help sometimes. But 
we all deserve a what the fuck you've seen us at our worst and we've seen you at your best and i'm proud to say you have all graduated from the intern program Woo! Yes. that's what i'm talking about you are all now officially junior agents of the psychonauts junior i'll take it <laughs> she said, bitch! <laughs> Junior! Wendy Hunt, generals! Alright. So that's Psychonauts, too. Uh, that was a stretch. <laughs> Sorry. So that's Psychonauts too. Um, I hope there's a scene after this because I want to know what happened to the rest of the uh, founding members. I would like to see uh, um, Helmet in them all again, right? But um, Psychonauts too, definitely a step up from the first Psychonauts game. It's nice. Uh, when it comes to the powers and stuff, I. Uh, I don't hate them, but they do feel a little nerfed compared to uh, what we had in the first game. All right? I wish instead of having like this slow build up, like um, area of effect for the fire, it would just work like the last game, but just like better, you know? Where you just aim and then you set them on fire with the meter. Same thing with the side blast. It felt pretty weak compared to uh, everything else, but I mean, if it wasn't, then I guess you would just beat the bosses and like. In like two seconds. Sorry, that was a hiccup. Holy shit. The characters are pretty good. All the characters are great. I love them. I don't think there's any character that I like hate it talking to or anything like that. Um, <laughs> like I know I give a uh, Norma, Norma like a fucking piece of my mind, but she's pretty cool, right? I still think Liz is cool as fuck though. But um, yeah. I wish they would have done more with the other characters, but you know, I guess, you know. It's not... I wish they would have done more with uh, Sasha 9 and, like, Mia and, like, uh, you know, uh, fucking Lily and them, right? Because they were kind of, they were kind of, like, supporting characters that came in toward the end, right? You expect that they would do more, you know? Um, but it, it's not too bad. They, I mean, they had two games to shine already, right? Uh, the levels are pretty good. Levels are pretty good. Writing was fucking funny as fuck. <laughs> I liked it. The combat. Combat, they went for more fast-paced combat. I wish that the lock-on was... Hmm. I don't know. I I understand how the lock-on is supposed to work. But, uh... I just, want, I just want to move the camera around while I'm locking on. I wish there was a different button to switch. Um, you know to switch uh which enemy you're locked on to because you're getting attacked by everything at once and you know when you lock on and you want to turn around and look <laughs> you got to go through like 50 different enemies while you're getting shot in the back um clairvoyance i find it interesting that they uh took clairvoyance and put that into combat as well but they only used it for the um i forgot what what are they called bad moods <laughs> That's only the really, you know, that's only the real time you use clairvoyance. You know, but clairvoyance is nice. It's a nice little, like, it's one of those things where you look at it and you go, Oh, that's nice. Nice little details. I want to use clairvoyance and everything. I want everyone to, I want to know where everyone sees me as, right? Music was pretty okay. I liked it. Um, I wish, I wish, one of the big parts that they were talking about when this um game was uh, coming out and stuff like that they're like you're gonna learn more about raz's family and stuff like that and it's like yeah it's cool but i wish they were involved way more than what they actually were you know like i like they're like man his sister Frazy, she's a psychic right and you know since since i'm like i'm like it's not my place to tell the family her secret even if it is a secret or not but at no point in the game did it ever come up, really. You know? 
um the family was kind of they're just kind of there and it sucks because they look cool you know you want to hang out with raz's family they look cool as fuck they get this awesome intro when they're fucking around with raz and throwing him around it's pretty it's pretty uh great now here's jack black and his fucking song it's pretty good um uh let's see <laughs> i don't know there's like it's like a lot but then also not a lot to say about the game <laughs> overall overall i found it good some hiccups here and there but it's definitely a step up and if you like the if you like psychonauts before you're definitely gonna like it more now um i like <laughs> i like the persona 5 heist that they had at the beginning <laughs> it's like what the fuck that's pretty good I just wish that the PC version didn't like stutter every time you got into a new area, right? Whenever you load it up, it had like this stutter that was pretty apparent, you know, it would freeze for a second. Like that kind of throws you out of the loop. I, I'm assuming that maybe the console version doesn't, uh, doesn't do that. And maybe it's just the PC. Probably if I lowered like a setting or two, it would probably stop or something. Um, what else is there? Uh, da -da 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 -da. what else is there? Hmm. The, uh, they had the fucking, what, what is it called? The, damn it, I forgot the name of the, name of the fucking, uh, power. The one where you make your own little, your own little self. They had that. I, I find that pretty funny because I'm assuming that's the voice actor of Gur doing that role. Because now you just have Zim and Gur just fucking about. At least it felt like Gur <laughs> walking around going, doo 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 doo. Man, that was pretty fun. Uh, I didn't finish the fucking, I didn't finish the side quest for, um, for fucking, for the scavenger hunt. I kind of wanted to. Also, speaking about fucking all those systems and stuff, I am not a fan of the level up system in this, you know? Because in the first game, it's like you just collect your, uh, your side challenge markers or whatever, and then, you know, they all come together. You know, it's a nice little collectathon. They all come together and you get the levels as you, the more you collect and you just automatically rank up. And you get some pretty good levels in there. Again, with the side blast, like you get chain side blast and now you have infinite ammo and fucking, and like uh, it would do heavy damage and stuff like that. This one's like, eh, you get four side blasts and then you wait for a cooldown. And it kind of just, it's weird because the, the combat wants to be fast paced, but your powers aren't fast paced. And it's so weird. Also, I don't know why they tuck out the ability to hit shit with melee while you're using the levitation ball, because that was pretty, that was pretty, you know, that was pretty awesome in the first game, right? Um, I don't know. I don't know. There, there's definitely some hit or miss things in here. Uh, for the longest time, for the longest time, I'm not sure, I probably missed it somewhere, but for the longest time, I remember, uh, you know, I would watch, um, I watch James Willems and stuff like that. He always talk about Psychonauts and shit. And uh, with Tim Schafer, he's like, if I can be in the game, I just want to voice a toilet. I wonder if that's in this game. <laughs> I wonder if that's it. It should be in this game, right? It's probably somewhere. Maybe I saw it and just didn't realize it, right? But let's see. These are going to be some long credits, aren't they? But um, it's nice to see a part, a part of me. A part of me is just like kind of sad because i'm like oh no double fines owned by xbox now no no <laughs> but at the same time i'm like it's nice that they have official backing now because double fine games are pretty fucking good they're pretty good they're fun i like them they have great writing fun characters uh wonderful music that fits the mood perfectly and you know this is just another stepping stone for them to uh come up in the world right Get there, get the spot, get the spot that they always deserved. Cause they kind of been an independent studio for so long, but they've done so many games. They've been around for a while, right? And it's like, it's like now a bigger company, like they own you, but I feel so far from what I'm hearing is that, you know, Microsoft has been pretty hands off, right? Which is great. Cause you know, give Double Fine a bunch of funding and don't tell them to do any crazy shit. And they're going to come up with something really great. Maybe we'll get a Psychonauts 3 down the road. Oh my god, we get a Psychonauts 3. Ugh, amazing. One of the things that I also remember is that there were interviews where, um, where Tim Schafer was talking about 
he's like oh yeah psychonauts 2 we're gonna see what it's like to go into the mind of someone who's dying and stuff like that or someone who has been dead or something like that and it's like I get where he came from with that because that's what Helmet was, I assume. You know, all the senses are coming back, but I wish there was like a more darker feel to that, you know? Especially because this game is definitely more mature than the other games, which the other games were still pretty mature, you know? But they were they were that nice kid-friendly mature. This one is more like, you know, fucking young teen mature, right? Where, where instead of going like, oh no, that person's bad and they're doing bad things. Instead of that, they're going, huh. I killed my sister, <laughs> right? Um, you know, that whole plot point. That whole plot point is both cool but weird at the same time because I'm like, Crawler, what did you do? What did you do? He's like, I made a mistake, Raz. It's like, oh, Crawler, oh no. Right? And also there's like the, the revelation at the end. You go and you walk up to your dad and they're like, oh, he's been through some shit. And then let's just hug it. Let's just have a good hug. And oh my God, Peter McCollum. <laughs> Jesus, it's like, um, they're like, let's just hug it out, you know, and not say another word. And then, and then everything, everything is bad. Everything is better now. Go fight Maligula. There's like nothing more than that. I felt like there should have been something more than that. You know, I felt like that, uh, that ending was a little rushed there. Not going to lie. Um, it was still a good ending though. I liked it. I, I enjoyed it. Let's see. Yeah, but um, back to the back to the uh, <laughs> back to the more mature tones. I I wish I wish that you know going into the mind of someone who is you know someone who is dead or someone who is dying. I wish like we would have went in there and saw like some decay or something like that. You know, some like life regrets and stuff like that. Um, also the collectibles in this game, it's like. Maybe because I wasn't looking out for them, but they're def A, they're definitely more scattered than they were in the first game. And B, they're just kind of there. They're just kind of there. Right? They're just kind of there. I don't even think I don't even think you rank up from getting them. They're just collectibles. <laughs> they're just collectibles. Uh, but yeah, that's Psychonauts 2, basically. I enjoyed it. I liked it. I hope you guys liked it. You know, if uh, if you did enjoy the playthrough, please check out all the other playthroughs I have on my channel. In the description below, there's a link to my Twitch and my Twitter. You can follow me there on both of those. Um, Twitch, Twitch is a little iffy with me. Not gonna lie, I have like two nights that, for the most part, I'll be streaming there. But all the other days are kind of like if I find time to do it or not. I'll do it, but, uh, you know, some, uh, some of the playthroughs that I do on the channel, like the, like when you see the long videos, like the real long ones, those are coming from Twitch and you guys, you guys don't get those playthroughs until I finish the, you know, playthrough on Twitch. There's literally a game that I have on the back burner right now that I have, uh, streamed like almost like not even a year ago. What the hell am I saying? Like, like at the beginning in like February and I still haven't finished that game. So there's that. Um, what else is it? You know, on YouTube, leave a like, comment, comment, tell me what's your, tell me what your favorite part of the game was, tell me what your favorite level was, what was my favorite level, holy shit, now I think about it, because everything was kind of good, everything was pretty good, you know, everything was really good, but somehow it felt more linear than fucking, than, uh, <laughs> than the, than the first game, I don't know how they do that, because the first game wasn't even that linear. I mean that linear first game was a uh, pretty linear right and this one feels more linear I guess it's because in the first game you had like you know once you went to the asylum you had like a couple of choices of which which uh, level you wanted to do this one was just like nope you're doing this one which isn't bad at all uh agent bull had a pretty fun level and so did um so was the light so was the uh, librarian that was that was pretty good there's a lot of good levels. Jesus fuck. <laughs> there was a lot of good levels. You know, it was nice. Uh fucking. <laughs> I'm thinking of that amusement, that amusement park ride we were on. It's pretty cool. Um Yeah, but you know, please leave a like for the for the channel. Cause you know, 
YouTube's like, eh, you gotta, you gotta smash that like button. The more likes you get, more people watch. And the more we're gonna actually say, oh, guess what? You're a person and you exist. <laughs> Alright, let's see. I'm afraid to skip it. Because I feel like there's gonna be a scene after this. And I don't want to skip the scene after it. Look at that dumbass goat. I graduated the intern program and all, but I'll bet if I snuck in a little extra credit work, that would really irritate Norma. And that's it. Where are you going on vacay? Excuse me, Agent Foresight? Yes, Rasputin? You're cool, Foresight. I like you. Can you be my new mom? Hmm. I just wanted to apologize. No, no, no. I thought we agreed not to talk about that again. Oh, I love you. <laughs> we did? Listen, in the end, I was the adult in the room. You were the child. I take full responsibility. And the whole thing is just so embarrassing. So let's just move the mission log to the classified file, okay? <laughs> oh, that's great. So... What will you do with Crystal Mallet? Well, we don't want any publicity about it, or we'd have to give up Malig... Lucretia. So we'll probably just keep Mallet here. Maybe give him to Agent 9 for experiments. Oh! Experiments? You're going to experiment on Crystal? Heavens no! That's terrible. Why would you say such a thing? You said... I said we'd give him to Sasha for therapy. But no one likes an argumentative preteen Rasputin. <laughs> what the fuck? Whoa, you guys are so shady. Will you miss being the acting head of the Psychonauts? Not a bit. In fact, my main goal now is to convince Truman to put off retirement as long as I can. He's been threatening me with the title of Grand Head for years. But I do not need the grief. You want Ford to come back and work at headquarters? Absolutely. Nobody gets my hair like Agent Crow. <laughs> <laughs> what will you do with Lucretia? I'd like to keep her under observation. What about the government? The Grulovian secret police? Please, this is Psychonauts' business. I'll bet you're happy my family is leaving soon. Actually... I've invited them to stay. Jesus what? fuck, why would you do that? I see a lot of potential in that sister. Of oh god. Little brother. And even your father. Are you going to make my family into psychonauts? Well, we should at least teach them psycho safety. Can't have them running loose leaving a trail of burning pine cones behind them. What are you doing out here? Just relaxing, waiting for my flight to the tropics. I'm off the clock, but I'm happy to answer any non-work related questions. Where will you go on your vacation? Oh, well, Agents 9 and Vodella were nice enough to give me this all expense paid tropical vacation. Look. That's oh, fuck. Good. Well, it better be. That prescription sunblock I bought wasn't cheap. Oh, no. Have fun on your <laughs> That's the that's the employee of the year. Octopus while snorkeling, I'll think of you. <laughs> right before I shoot it with my spear gun. Oh God. Okay. Oh man, I totally want to go and talk to everybody right now, but uh, <laughs> this video is going on for long enough. So, once again, thank you guys for watching. I did my whole spiel earlier. Uh, but once again, if you enjoyed, please click the like button, leave a comment, blah 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 blah. Watch my other shit, and uh. Yeah, there's that. So, thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next playthrough. Stay happy, stay healthy, and take care. I'm a chef what else should I be? Please don't take off.